Look at that purple head. That that's hypo if I've ever seen one. What's up, everybody? Anthony with Granddaddy Herbs back again with another video. Today's video is going to be an awesome, awesome video. So this was a uh, a breeding that I just I knew was going to be a good one when I decided to pair them up. Them up. Uh, the dad is a black pastel crystal so he's a black pastel special mojave the uh crystal is an allelic combo meaning if i even breed a crystal to a normal i'm going to get only specials and mojaves so that helps strengthen the outcome of your clutches so black pastel special mojave 100 hit for hypo now at the time i bought the mail i had no intentions of even breeding for hypo i just really liked the crystal stuff so i wanted to produce more um but good thing i kept them around because i started getting into the hypo project the last few years and uh I've had a good female for him mom is a blackhead hypo red gene so we're looking to get some really awesome babies and we did so let's get right into this clutch cutting because it's going to be a good one okay guys we have another clutch to cut today um female is a blackhead hypo red gene and dad is a black pastel crystal which is a special mojave 100 head for hypo i've actually never proved him out when i bought him i bought him strictly for the crystal aspect um, this was about four or five years ago and uh, at the time I had no hypo in my collection So again, that wasn't my intentions, but once I got into the blackhead hypo stuff I realized this would actually a pretty solid male to put to her to try to prove her out prove him out I mean um, The goal is to hit a blackhead black pastel special hypo and uh, it also wouldn't hurt to hit a blackhead black pastel Mojave hypo either so let's uh, let's get into this clutch and see if the odds treat us right um, we've got seven eggs here. <laughs> I actually had to tape up two of them because when I separated them I was a little impatient I, I believe and uh, ended up tearing the sides of two of them and uh, I remember seeing Billy over at Mutation Creation use tape one time and figure I'd follow suit and it looks like uh, it worked but I think they'll naturally seal themselves off anyway but that's still a still a good little trick to know if you ever accidentally tear a little bit of the egg so keep that in mind so I'm excited there's a lot of darkness potential um, in this so um, let's let's get started here let's get started with these taped eggs let's go straight in the middle so the tape definitely did its job it's it's definitely sticking sticking a little too well <laughs> okay let's slide this over here get you guys in focus here you can see the little dot right here is actually where sorry a little shaky here um, that dot is where the hole was originally but it sealed off so come on blackhead hypo combos blackhead black pastel hypo combos those are gonna be awesome We've got seven chances. Let's see if we can prove this hypo early on. Ooh. That is a really, really nice combo there. So, I'm not exactly sure. Oh, sorry, guys. Got you guys out of focus. My apologies. I'm not exactly sure what this is. Let me turn the brightness up a little bit, maybe, for you guys. Um. It's a really, like, it looks like a potion. Like a mystic potion of some sort. But maybe that's the hypo. Maybe that's Black Pastel, Blackhead, Mojave, Hypo. I think we, we proved it out on the first egg. You see that up there on the dorsal? That looks, that looks hypo to me. Uh, we'll get a better look on that for you guys. Uh, those of you that are new, you see a little bit of blood. That's actually pretty normal. Um, the snakes are full term, so seeing a little bit of blood is not the end of the world. Um, the snake is fully developed, so it no longer really needs the uh, the veins for oxygen supply. Plus, there's a few other veins in there that'll help them in the meantime. But let's get into egg number two. I think that's I think that's the triple hypo visual right there. So I think we nailed it on the first egg. Not a bad way to start this clutch. So interesting that it's that light though 
Boom, we got another one, guys? Back to back? Look at that purple head. That That's hypo if I've ever seen one. Sheesh. Now let's hope that these are females. That is rad. Look at that, guys. You know, that macro lens, uh, it's gonna do awesome with these two. Damn, back to back purple snakes. Man, that is so cool. That's what we're shooting for right there. Now let's hope we can hit a special. Um, oh man, I can feel the snake big time in this egg. Wow, I'm, I'm loving this already. This is, this is good odds. But everything at the very least is gonna be special Mojave because the crystal is an axe like super. So we're not getting any normals. Ooh, this is a nice looking one. Man, three for three on the hypo? That's a black pastel special hypo. Look at that, guys. Because remember, everything has to be Mojave or um, special. And I'm leaning towards special over the Mojave. It could be a black pastel Mojave special, or sorry, black pastel Mojave hypo, but I'm leaning towards the special on that. Wow, what a beautiful snake. Look at that. That is wicked. So, I wonder if that is a visual hypo. But, I don't know, I don't think so. But we just, we got three for three on the hypos. Statistically, half the clutch should be hypo. But, huh, that's interesting. Let's see here. Let's go. If every single one of these is hypo, then that's gonna be interesting, which, there's another hypo. Wow, look at that. Sorry, let me get this camera on you guys. It wants, to, so there's so much white around that the camera's having a hard time focus. We are four for four on hypos. Yo, look at that. Okay, maybe the last one was a black pastel um, Mojave um, hypo. Maybe this is the black pastel, maybe this is the black pastel blackhead special hypo I'm not too sure but let me get these side by side you guys can maybe see the difference I know the light glare yo this clutch is insane this clutch is absolutely insane we are four for four on a hypo that is wicked huh I'm 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 lost for words right now I am very lost for words. I've been getting really bad odds when it comes to my clowns this season. Um, maybe I'm making up for it in this clutch. Okay, I think I got my first non-hypo. Yes, I did, my first non-hypo. So, we know that he's not, He's that he's just a head because mom is a visual. So that is a uh, black pastel special head hypo right there. You can see that there. There we go. Black pastel special. All right, let's get some more dark stuff in here. Come on, we got two more eggs. But man, I'm digging this clutch, man. It's, it's already surpassing my expectations, what I had. Man, I can't wait to see these purple ones and then this wicked one when it comes out. I love my dark jeans. If a lot of you haven't guessed already, I love my dark stuff. That's why I play with Blackhead and Black Pastel. Oh no. I think we've got a kink. That egg looks like it's partially cooked. That's gonna be a, that's gonna be a, unfortunately that's gonna be an animal I'm gonna have to put down. I, I can already tell. So, you can see a lot of this white stuff over here. That's not looking good. Generally when you see like partially cooked egg in the inside, that means the snake's gonna be kinked up or deformed. So, man, I was doing good so far this, this season, but Looks like we've got one. Well, let's just hope that the rest aren't like that. You know, normally when there's one, there's more. 
that's just kind of been the luck in the past for me. So let's, let's hope that's the only one like that. That's that's sad. That's a black pastel special head hypo right there. Oh man. Now I'm nervous for the whole clutch. I didn't see anything else from any of the other ones, but still it makes me very nervous. Let's see what we got. And we've got another purple snake. So there's another hypo combo right there. Look at that, you can see this one much clearer. So, wow, what a pretty snake. I think that's the whole shebang right there. Also, I think that's a blackhead, black pastel, Mojave um, hypo. So we, we hit five hypos out of this clutch. So really, really good odds there. So I will take it. Really bummed out about this, this snake right here. I don't like having deformities and whatnot. It's just, it's just not good. But all in all, clutch did turn out fantastic. I don't think I did too well with the special stuff. I think maybe these three are the, are the special. And the purple snakes I think are the Mojave but I think I did hit all the bangers with the Mojave. So yeah, we got some good looking stuff. So we'll stay tuned for the update guys. All right guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll have to update you guys on this clutch by next week. I actually plan on doing an update on, I think the first, or maybe I think it's clutches five through eight or five through nine. I'll be updating you guys next week. I'm so behind on giving you guys the updates. Most of that stuff is already shed and had a meal or two. Even some of it's already sold. So I want to get them shown off before um, I no longer have them. Uh, matter of fact, two animals from this clutch cutting have already sold. So that's how far behind I am. But I will uh, I will be updating you guys. So stay tuned. Also, check the links in the description. Um, I've got some stuff going up on Morph Market. You better get to it before it's gone. Um, I will see you guys on Instagram. See you later. Peace. Oh, yeah. Hey, I got something, something to say. I'm just so sick of hearing everyone complain. I know it's tough and I know there's pain. But hitting bottom is the only way to change. So I'll keep hustling, you keep struggling, bitch I'm humbling, keep mumbling, I'll keep doubling, you keep bluffing, you've got nothing, I'll keep hustling.